Once everyone was standing idly by Just a short walk from the famous Charles Bridge on the Grand Priory Square there is a wall called the Lennon Wall but John Lennon had never visited Prague so why is it named after him? During the communist regime in Czechoslovakia listening to western music was prohibited however people listened to the Beatles Rolling Stones and other popular bands from behind the Iron Curtain in secret. Especially John Lennon's songs about love, world peace and freedom influenced people living under the communist rule and gave them hope. But even though this wall was the place where people were writing love poems and messages against the totalitarian regime since the 1960s, the first message connected to John Lennon appeared on the wall following his assassination in 1980 when an unknown artist secretly painted John's portrait and a few lyrics from his songs. Then more and more people supported this idea and the white wall was suddenly colourful and full of lyrics from John Lennon's songs and wishes for freedom and world peace. The Velvet Revolution in 1989 ended communism in Czechoslovakia and the Lenin War became a symbol of peace, love and freedom forever. Please pay respect. On the way to the Charles Bridge, literally around the corner from the Lenin War, you shouldn't miss this cosy, Beatles-inspired restaurant. One of our favourites in Prague. It's called the Wall Club, and it's definitely worth a visit. Their food is delicious. And next to the Lenin Wall, and opposite the French Embassy, there is the Grand Priory Palace and a little taste of France, Café de Paris. The building is owned by the Order of the Maltese Cross called the Maltese Knights, but that's another story, so please stay connected. <laughs> 